Hello friends, welcome to Quick Learn Tutorial Series. In this video, I will explain you Step Up Chopper, its working operation and waveform. Before we discuss about Step Up Chopper, we all know about what is Chopper. Chopper is basically a high speed semiconductor switching device that convert fixed DC input voltage into variable DC output voltage. Or simply we can say that Chopper is a DC to DC converter. So there are basically two type of chopper, step up chopper and step down chopper. So here we discuss step up chopper. It is also known as boost converter. Step up chopper is basically used to obtain a load voltage higher than the input voltage. Or we can say that step up chopper increase or boost up the power level of output voltage as compared to the supply voltage. So the output of the step up chopper is always greater than or equal to the supply voltage. That is why it is called boost converter. Now this is the circuit diagram of a step up chopper. Here we use a supply voltage Vs at the input side, inductor, a chopper. For chopper we use any type of high speed semiconductor switching device just like JTO, SCR, IGBT etc, diode and the load resistance RF. Now chopper having two mode of operation. First is when chopper is on and second mode of operation is chopper is off. So here we see what happened when chopper is on. When chopper is on it means the switch is closed. When this switch is closed the supply voltage disconnect from the load side. This time the inductor start charging with voltage Vs. When inductor charge, the polarity across the inductor, this terminal is positive and this is negative. And the current across inductor start rising from its minimum value to its maximum value. And the current flow across the closed close circuit path from Vs, L, chopper or switch and again Vs. This is the direction of current flow. That time the output voltage across load equal to zero. Now the second mode of operation when chopper is off. So let us see what happened when chopper is off. When chopper is off means switch is open. When this switch is open this time inductor start discharging and we know that this is the property of inductor. When inductor discharge, it changes its polarity. So this terminal is negative this time and this is positive. And diode D is start conducting. So the current flow in the direction or the loop Vs, L, diode D and output. This is the closed circuit path in from which current flow. This time the output voltage across the load is Vs plus Vf. So the operation of the step up chopper I explain with the help of waveform. This is the supply voltage Vs. It means it is a fixed DC supply, constant DC. This is the supply current, output voltage and output current waveform. So this is the total time period T at which the two mode of operation of chopper. First mode is chopper is on and chopper is off. T is also known as chopping period. So first when chopper is on, inductor start charging from its minimum value to maximum value. So the inductor start charging from I1 to I2. At that time, the output voltage across load as we discussed early is zero. The next mode of operation is when chopper is off. When chopper is off, inductor start discharging by changing its polarity from maximum to minimum. That time the output voltage across load is greater than the supply voltage. Again the cycle is repeated. Again once chopper is on and once chopper is off. When chopper is on, inductor charging with minimum to maximum value of current and 
output voltage equal to zero. When chopper is off, inductor discharge voltage across output is greater than the supply voltage. Now, during the turn off period of when chopper is turn off, it means open. The polarity across the inductor is reverse. It means this is negative and this is positive. This time output voltage we find here output voltage across load is V output equal to Vs plus Vl or Vl we can say that LDI by DT which is more than the supply voltage and the current across the inductor fall from maximum to the minimum. Now if we apply KCL during this condition, we get VL, it means the voltage across inductor equal to V output minus Vs. Now during the turn on time of chopper, inductor store energy and during turn off time of chopper, inductor release energy. So let us see how much energy is stored by the inductor when chopper is on and how much energy released by the inductor when chopper is off. So first condition during turn on time energy stored by the inductor is given by omega on that is equals to voltage across L, average current through L and T on. So the voltage across L is equal to Vs, average current across L I, I maximum plus I minimum divided by 2 during T on time. This is equation 1. Next condition during turn off time inductor release energy or start discharging. This time omega of equal to voltage across inductor average current through inductor at T of time. So the voltage across inductor that is equals to V output minus Vs average current I maximum plus I minimum divided by 2 and T of time. This is the equation number second. Now if we consider the system is lossless, it means the two energy, the energy stored by the inductor during T on time and the energy released by the inductor during turn off time will be equal. So omega on equal to omega off. So we put the value of omega on or omega off. This is the value. Now after solving this. So after solving this we get V output equal to Vs T by T minus T on. So V output equal to Vs 1 by 1 minus D. Where D is the duty cycle that is equals to T on by T. The average value across the load can be step up by varying the duty cycle. So if switch is always off, it means the duty cycle equal to zero, output voltage equal to Vs. If switch is always on, D equal to one, it means V output equal to infinite. Now if we consider the third condition, the duty cycle is 0 0.5. So this time the load voltage is 200% of the input DC voltage. It means in a step up chopper, the output voltage is always greater than or equal to the supply voltage. So guys, thank you for watching this video. For more videos, please like, subscribe and share my channel.